Hi everyone, this is Larry with Unique Medical, and we're going to continue on our path with another episode of The Power of Peptides. Um, during these videos, I seem to look in the wrong spot, just FYI. I'm trying to look at the camera, but I forget. But anyway, let's talk about peptides. Um, today we're going to talk about PTD-DBM. This is a hair growth peptide. I know that's a very popular subject amongst my clients um, because my ladies and my men are always worrying about hair loss, especially when we get into testosterone replacement. So this is going to be a peptide that I start using with anybody either who A, wants it, or B, is on some kind of testosterone uh, therapy. What this peptide does is it works on the Wnt B ketian pathway. I know that's a, that's a mouthful. What it does is it rescues the DHT-induced suppression of the hair follicle stem cell. So it's going to prevent any kind of suppression that DHT may have on that stem cell so that that stem cell can proliferate. And what we also do is we add valparic acid to it um, so that it does have this proliferative ability. So this one is going to be a, a big deal in clinical practice. This one is going to focus on the hair. So the IPS, International Peptide Society, actually did a clinical trial with this. We call it an IRB to prove to everyone that peptides really, really work. And there's no better way than to do that than to do something research-wise that can be seen with the eye. So what they did is they, they worked on a hair protocol, and this was part of their hair protocol, and it showed significant growth um, in humans and as well in, in rats. And I don't know how to do the little, how I put a picture up here of the rat study to show the, the group where they used the PTD and valproic acid. Hair growth was significantly um, improved with, with that particular rat and, and with the humans. So this is a peptide for hair growth for men and women. So it's going to increase stem cells at the hair follicle area. Those that have been suppressed, it's going to rescue those stem cells. So the hair should get fuller and be better. Now, if you are a man and you are shiny, shiny, shiny bald, um, this topical application, that's how this is, it's topically delivered, um, probably isn't going to work without some microneedling it into the scalp and doing some PRP and potentially some other growth factors or stem cells to kind of get it going and maybe there would be a result. Um, I'm not going to make any claims on that, uh, but I will make claims that you know the literature shows that this can definitely improve hair. This isn't a, a short-term thing. You've got to be on this minimum of four months. And it's something that you can continue forever, especially if you're on some kind of hormone therapy. So this is one I look to get a lot of experience with because I'm assuming my clients are going to jump all over this one. So if you have any questions about PTD DBM, let us know. Call the office. Um, we're going to be getting this peptide rolling soon. The issue is the pharmacy hasn't gotten it quite ready for market. I've been ready to roll this out for about two weeks, but that's besides this point. So hopefully we'll get this peptide out and I'll get some good, good feedback on this one. I'm really excited about this for my clients. So um, that's just another peptide. It's going to be pretty awesome and powerful. Um, have a good day, everybody. Get optimized and ask questions if you got them. Drop a line. Have a good day.